I'm not saying, but don't they know what they mean? Are you listening to me? They ain't gonna name all this so crazy stuff. Are you listening to me? That's when Mac and Mac come on, his, his name, I don't forget his last name. He said, I'm just an ex, because I don't know who I come from. Mm -hmm. uh, ex. Mm -hmm. Ex generation. Anyway, mm -hmm. praise God. Are you listening to me? Amen. Now, and I will make thee exceedingly fruitful. Wait a minute, man. Hello? Mm -hmm. And I will make nations of thee. And kings shall come what? <coughs> Amen. Do you hear me good? Amen. Amen. <coughs> Make you fruitful. Now, now listen. Now, here we go. Now he done already tried to help him. And here comes God come over here and saying something different. Because see, we tried to help God. I told you, man, I do not believe this. You know, it's people. I'm going to say this. And I'm saying it with every intent. We'll pray for you to get a job. I guarantee you next week. Church, they don't like the job. Mm -hmm. yeah. Something wrong with your head. Mm -hmm. Well, hard. Let's put it there. Your heart is right. Because if you, we pray for you to get the job, mm -hmm. what do you think you're going to go and train to supervise? Amen. Mm -hmm. Even if you would, you would know what to do with it. Mm -hmm. Hello here. Yeah. It'll run your, hey, your nerves will be so you come home and you probably turn the next corner and go to wrong. <laughs> 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 You know what they're doing? They can all wait and they stand back and go, I think we ought to be doing this way. My God, you hear me good. Now you listen to me. You don't know what the sound means you're talking about. You can't have the grit, man. You can't have the grit. Hey, hey man, I'm, I, hey, I'm, just, I'm just telling people that I be hearing that. But if God said, listen, God sent me down to the first church, I could not move to God tell me. I didn't try to run off either. I just talked to the preacher. They told okay, you can go. Amen. Mm -hmm. He got to say so you can go. Praise God, because this is what I believe. Mm -hmm. I believe God. Now, God, God worked it out. You know, we, we talked over here, but finally God fixed it. Brother, no, right that word. Well, he had to come over there and come right back there and acknowledge that he got a problem. Come on, give God some good. He's out, he's a man, you didn't do like me. He's out messed up. He's I'm fine, I'm all, I ain't quite there yet, but I'm gonna I, 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 I glory be to God. I didn't say glory be to Taylor, I said glory be to God. Come on, good God. Come on, God, take us for you. I just thank God for my daddy didn't deal with me. I know you don't want your daddy. You want him to just come lick you up and you want to give everything like you ain't here. I don't care about that stuff. Mm -hmm. But you know what he told me one night sitting there? My mama told me one day I ready to go to school. I started school. She said, when you go to school, go on the table, son. Come on, bless it. had Johnson on. Are you listening to me? She said, you go on the table. And so he was sitting there one night with him. He said, you know what? I'm so glad you, you my God, you went on the table. Now he wasn't doing nothing for me. But he can't take credit for it. Come on, give God some praise. <laughs> but praise is the only thing God takes on it in the whole world. <laughs> Don't matter. Praise God. Taylor. Amen. Do you hear me? Good. Taylor, man. Taylor. Capital T, man. Come <laughs> on, give God some praise. Something. Watch this one. I'm moving quick to you. He said, I will make thee exceedingly fruitful, and I will make nations of thee, and kings shall come out of thee. And I will establish my covenant between thee and me, and thy seed. It will go again. Do you see that? Amen. Thy seed after thee in their generation. For what? <laughs> to be a God unto thee, and to thy what? Yeah. And I will give unto thee what? In thy seed. After thee, the land wherein thou art a stranger. All the land of Canaan for an everlasting possession. And I will be what? And God said unto Abraham, Thou shalt keep my covenant. Therefore, thou in thy seed what? In their generation. Watch this. We ain't do. This is my covenant which thou shalt keep between me and you and who? <laughs> and after thee, every man child among you shall be what? Good God to me. Are you listening to me? Now, brother, you know what I'm, I'm figuring out? What is God seeing? What did God see in this heathen man? Why God can't find him? 
Mm-hmm. Why God can't find it? He found it in his heathen man. Do you hear me, good church? Yeah. And my God is such a privilege that I'm what I'm going to talk to you about just a second, man. And the people that embrace it. Yeah. Because God kept, he kept, notice God, Abraham was built an altar to God quick, man. Yeah. And Abraham understood something. He was getting old enough. Well, God, you know I'm not getting younger. You know, God know that. Yeah. You don't put God in remembrance of your age. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. God, you know I ain't getting no younger now. What am I having, baby, now? Yeah. Praise God. Well, God, pray for you. Take away for 25 years, you pray for this going right in Christ. I can just <laughs> help me, Lord. Are you listening? Lord? Help me here, Jesus. Are you listening? Thank you, Lord. Let's, let's go on and get to the 18th chapter. Amen. If you don't you go okay with me. Amen. You're not mad, are you? Thank you, Lord. Eighteen and one, you see that? Amen. And the Lord appeared unto him in the in the in the plant of Moriah. And he sat in the tent door in the heat of the day. And he lifted up his eyes and looked, and lo, three men stood by him. When he saw them, he ran to meet them. You see that? Eighteen and one. Amen. Amen. And he saw them and he met them from the tent door and bowed himself toward the ground. He said, My Lord, if I have found faith in thy sight, pass not away, I pray thee, from thy servant. Now, God is, is steady confirming himself. And this is what God do with us, man. He steady confirming himself with us as we not on this journey alone. Amen. Now, Abraham don't have anybody to trust with God, amen. amen. Now, just think, he don't have it in the book. He don't have it in the family. It's all about him. Yeah. Now, this man <coughs> comes from a heathen nation mm-hmm. where they worship our God, where they burn their children. Mm-hmm. Are you listening to right? Amen. Where they burn their children, amen? Mm-hmm. But how could this God reach out and find this man? Mm-hmm. What is God up to? Amen. Huh? I'm going to bless all the families on the earth with you, and I ain't got a damn child. Then you get one, and God chastises you about that. You know that ain't the way. He already know that. Amen. He already did that. Listen, no, listen, so you understand what I'm saying. It ain't that he couldn't have gotten hey guy any time he wanted to, Amen. but his wife brought it up, and they talked about it, and made a cut and said, look, I ain't going to have no babies. God, no, no doubt, I'm just talking now, yeah. and no doubt God ain't going to give us nothing, and we getting really old, you know, I can't be doing nothing. I ain't really want no man no way, man. <laughs> and Abe said, well, you know, you're about right there. And uh, hey, guys, she's pretty young, so, you know, she a fox, so, well, if she ain't a fox, you know, she, uh, she you, you know, maybe, maybe, you know, uh, 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 she a she bear or something. <laughs> and my God, you know, maybe, maybe Sarah, I was a fox, but she didn't have no fire burning. You know what I'm talking about? Yeah. You know what I'm talking about? I need some fire burning. You know what I'm talking about? You know, but she had to persuade him some kind of way. Yes. She just said, hey, boy, go ahead and be right. But he said, she gave him, said, that's your wife too. Mm-hmm. Are you listening to me? Mm-hmm. Amen. Two women in one house, somebody will kill somebody. Amen. <laughs> So well, I told this, this, this white guy, you know, what went on, Al Matthew, you know, he, he coming down and he told him he started messing with this baby and then work together. And he said, I told Billy Jane that, that I would be on this, that, that, that one guy. And I said, what did you say? <laughs> I said, man, if you married the black one, you would be dead. I said, yeah. right, right on this spot. <laughs> and the lovely chief way is blind and crippled and crazy. Well, uh, 80 years old, she tell you tell her, she 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 uh, amen. Him and his son, I go look at it, you know, I'm looking at him. He's on green, he's supposed to be on reading. Amen. And Colin gets mad and he, he, 
He, he won't do it. He got to run by them fat men in the house. Everybody just forget about church. And we can specify how David had affection for the house of the Lord. Amen. You understand what I'm saying? Now, why don't you pay attention to other stuff than that thumb thing? Just eat just. He don't pay like he here. Amen. He do, but he comes out his time. <laughs> But so did everybody else. Right. Amen. Huh? Amen. Are you listening to me? Don't try to please yourself. Now we have a, a Nick here. Wow. Name, we call him the Dennis Dean. And, and he would, I had to put a sign up there, but not the food that, that thumb that Mother Grace was on. Yeah. But when we was at another place, he just don't he won't eat hot all the time. He turned it down low to me. Yeah. Oh. Just trying to freeze everybody. Yeah. So I, I tell you, I said, don't know about that. I know him. But you know, you want to be kind of, you know, we want to be a little silver with people, you know, a little silver, you know, diplomatically. <laughs> I said, hey, don't go buy food for something, man. He's the only one messing with me. So I just, I got to say to make me a sign for the do not take some of that. Say the cop. Hmm? Only time to take away, he's going to look at it. <laughs> Are you listening to me? Tell me, Lord. Tell me, Lord. Tell me, Lord. Thank God. Are you listening to me? So, what, what I'm going to tell you now, what is this, this God and all the other people in this earth, and God is working with this man, he told a lie because he told him to walk the point first, but he didn't walk the point he told him not, but he is accounted because he believed God, and God made the promise to him. Are you listening to me? Now, I, I'm going to tell you this then. Don't come here telling me, looking back, if you use that word to me, I want to stop talking to you. Because I don't use that word. Amen. I don't look back. I shall reflect back in the world. Say it. Because they don't understand teaching. Amen. See, they won't take heed to it. Are you listening to me? I don't use the word. It's the same way. Listen to me, Trey. Can I talk to you? Man? Amen. Amen. It's like if I change the key to my door, then I don't try to take the old key and put it in the door because I know they old. Huh? I don't try to take the old combination and use it on the new stuff. It won't work. I'm a learner. Amen. You tell me, I'm not going to deal with that. Amen. It's out of my spirit. I'll crucify it. I'll be talking to God. I'm so, I mean, no, no. I think about it. See that thing you don't hear? Uh -huh. I think about it. It's very few times I'm going to move back in that area. Are you listening to me? Yeah. It's kind of like this. I tell them like this. You take that, that little baby that girl have, and you put that father and you have this hot. I guarantee that man hot. Yeah, ain't changing nothing more. Mm -hmm. Now, how you change a baby? I ain't went to school or something. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> can't teach the grown folks. Keep saying I'm looking back. I, that's why you in shape. You, you know, run to everything. But part of your brain. You know? <laughs> part of your brain. Like, come, let me tell you something. Sometimes you be around a lot of carnal people. You keep saying what they say. Go mm -hmm. away a lot of people. They spend more time around carnal people. They do saints. You know, you're not saying me. And sometimes when people get around saints, they want to make like they so spiritual mm -hmm. and they so up in tour mm -hmm. being religious. You know. Oh, you listen to me. Yeah, yeah. listen to you. Well, I see you not religious. Thank you. 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 Th